In today's lesson, we will look at the Nematype, why TypeScript needed to add it to the type system to overcome problems that many other programming languages don't have and how it ends up being extremely useful in real-world JavaScript code. Let's go. Now, the TypeScript type system actively does code flow analysis. And one example of code flow analysis might be realizing that a function never actively returns. For example, this function always throws an exception and TypeScript infers that the return type for this function should be never. Another example of a function that never returns would be something that has a very obvious infinite loop, for example, a while true. Once more in such a function expression, TypeScript would infer the return type to be never. Now let's go ahead and look at a few examples where we can use this type to our advantage. One interesting fact about the never type is only something of type never can be assigned to it. So if we try to assign anything else, for example, a number in this case, then the compiler is going to raise an error. We can use this fact to ensure that all important cases are handled in our code base. For example, here we have two distinct interfaces, one for a square and one for a rectangle. And then we have a type shape, which can either be a square or a rectangle. And our objective is to create a function that returns the area of either of these given shapes. Now within the function body, we can use the never type to ensure that all cases for the type shape are handled. We start off by creating a never variable and assigning it to S. At this point, we will get a compiler error and this error will not go away as long as S is not of type never. We can use this error to our advantage to force our hand into handling all the cases for type shape. First, we handle the case for square and with the square ruled out, we still have the error for rectangle. So TypeScript continues to force our hand to handle the other case, which is rectangle. We go ahead and add the special case as well as the return value for that. And once that is done, S is inferred to be of type never and the error goes away. We can actually leave this statement within the area function to continue to ensure that all cases for shape are handled by the area function well into the future. For example, if we get another use case for a different interface like a circle that becomes a part of the shape type, then our existing statement on ensure all cases are handled will point out that circle is not assignable to never forcing our hand once more to handle this particular case. And once that is done, the error on our ensure statement goes away because once more S is inferred to be never. There are a lot of tricks and tips within TypeScript that utilize the never type. Fundamentally, they ensure future correctness by poisoning the type system. Thanks for watching. Smash that like and subscribe for more content like this and I'll see you in the next one.